Einen wunderschönen guten Tag, ihr Morgana-Fans. Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Persona 5 Dancing in Starlight. Wir gucken uns jetzt erst die Social Links an, die wir hier noch offen haben. Und dann wird wieder ein bisschen rumgedanced. Morganas Traumstufe 7, das heißt wieder eine Karte finden. Welcome, Lady Anne. Barista, two of your finest coffees, please. One for me and one for the lady here. Don't worry about it. I was just gonna pop in for a quick chat and then get back to practice. Oh. In that case, what did you want to talk about? Well, I was just thinking about how weird this dream is. I mean, everyone's here with us, and the world is so realistic, you can't tell the difference. I don't think I'd even know it was a dream if you didn't look like that, Morgana. Oh yeah, I'd almost forgotten this wasn't the waking world. But so long as we're not all stuck in one big nightmare, dreaming isn't so bad. Hey, did you know your dreams have meaning? There's even a type of fortune-telling based on it. Fortune-telling, huh? Your dreams reveal what you're really thinking deep down. They can even predict the future. A flying dream means you long for independence. Swimming means your hard work will be rewarded. Then, maybe the dream we're having now has meaning too. Bingo. The book I read totally had a section on dancing dreams. That's pinpoint accuracy if I've ever seen it. Having a dancing dream means you want to express feelings that you've been keeping hidden away. Dancing in front of a crowd like this could be a subconscious way of conveying those emotions. Yeah, sounds right to me. One more thing. Dancing with someone of the opposite sex means you'll have romantic success in the near future. Bro, romantic success? Uh, you okay, Morgana? I <laughs> guess that fortune-telling book was spot on, then. Hey, Lady Han. Would you, um, like to dance with me? I'm ready and raring to go. Oh, shoot. I really talked your ear off there. I should probably be getting back. Huh? I have a routine to practice, after all. Right. In that case, I'll walk you down to the dance floor, like only a true gentleman would. Thanks! Psst. I'm gonna find a way to dance with Lady on one way or another. Just you watch. And if things get romantic, well... That's just how it was meant to be. Da will die Pussy wohl mit der Pussy spielen. So, wir haben wieder eine Karte, den Raum kennen wir ja schon, deswegen müssen wir uns jetzt hier nicht noch weiter großartig umgucken. Ähm, wir suchen jetzt die Karte. Da ist sie doch schon. Also mit Kreis könnt ihr euch im Übrigen hinknien. Heftlings Outfit. Sehr gut. Und Halloween Kostüme. Und Morgana Sotoran 8. Da können wir ja gleich weitermachen. This mission has really been something. It looks like everyone's risen to the challenge though. 
You know, maybe we should change our name to the Phantom Thieves of Song and Dance. I was actually kind of joking. But if you're really serious about it, maybe we can figure something out. All things considered, though, we did a great job of getting this ball up and running. The audience seemed to be enjoying themselves, and we got to have fun at the same time. It's strange, though. First we end up in this bizarre dream world, then those twins ask us to dance for them. <laughs> Maybe so, but you still got it done. Not that I'm surprised. Humans are full of possibility, after all. Being with you just reaffirms that fact. By the way, do you... Do you think I'm full of possibility, too? Oh. Right. If you say so, then it has to be true. Hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Look at me. Making this sound like a TV finale or something. I'm not about to let it end like this. We still have a lot of work to do before we can head home. The mission relies on us. I'll lead the charge as the most important member of the Phantom Thieves. And I'll win over Lady On in the process. I won't let this end as just a dream. Anyway, it's time for some dance practice. I might be talented, but I'm not about to rest on my laurels. I'll keep trying, keep pushing. I think you all could learn a thing or two from me. Maybe then you could draw out some of that possibility lying dormant within you. Well, I'm off. So, und die letzte Karte für Morgana. Ich weiß tatsächlich noch, wo sie war. Sie war nämlich da oben. Da habe ich letztes Mal nämlich ewig nachgesucht. Ich muss nur ewig hinkommen. So, komm schon. I love Tokyo Hotel. Here, <laughs> Teddy. <laughs> Sehr gut. Teddy aus Persona 4. Normalerweise hängt hier im Spiel noch so ein Reset-Poster. Das ist hier jetzt leider nicht, ne? Nun gut, gehen wir hier raus. Jubel-Toneinstellung ohne Konflikt hinzugefügt. Okay. So, Morgana ist fertig. Futaba geht irgendwie so überhaupt nicht voran. Okay, wir müssen mehr Songs spielen. Also Makoto ist die nächste. Auf dem Weg zur Ehefrau. Für alle Makoto Akira Shipper. That was quite the growl, Futaba. I'm starving. Moving around only makes me hungrier. Make me your special curry. This is an emergency. Right? You've got to do it. 
I don't think curry can be prepared that quickly. If you need something now, it'll have to be simple. Oh, I almost forgot! I've got munchies in my room! Three dozen cups of instant yakisoba! Three dozen? Are those emergency rations? Nope, just regular food. I eat them as a snack, so they disappear pretty quick. I'm a little concerned about you, Futaba. Your diet seems rather unbalanced. Are you eating the meals that Boss makes? You don't just fill up on junk food, do you? Depends on the situation. When I marathon anime all day, I tend to eat whatever munchies I have on hand. <sighs> Nutritional balance is important for maintaining a healthy body and mind. Keep your sodium intake below 5 grams a day and make sure to eat a wide variety of foods. What a pain in the butt. You're a growing girl, Futaba. If you don't eat properly, you'll ruin it. Growing? Crap, I forgot! So I still have a chance! If I go all out with this nutrition thing, will I grow tall and in all the right places, like on? I, I can't guarantee that, but I'm sure it will have a positive effect on you. I suddenly feel motivated. All I need to do is get nutrients, right? Got it. While you're at it, you should learn how to cook healthy meals on your own. If you'd like, I could teach you a few things. Please do! <laughs> Cooking only gets more rewarding when there are more people to share it with. You're a natural at this stuff, Makoto. You'll definitely be a top-tier wife someday! Wife? Let's not jump to conclusions here. Why not? We've all been thinking it. If that's what you're looking for, you'd prefer my sister. She makes quite a lot of money. But she does expect perfection. You'd better be ready for that. You know, it's great that you're so responsible and all, but those types tend to reel in hopeless guys. If you take such good care of them, they'll end up totally dependent on you. Better watch it! Um, thanks. I'll keep that in mind. <sighs> I didn't expect to be counseled by someone younger than me. You've got this, Makoto! Sub. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Uh, right. Yeah. I was kind of expecting this, but that's nothing like my room at all. Thank you. I prefer to keep it easy to move around in. It makes a good practice area for Aikido. For real? It's like a mini dojo. Aikido is part of my daily routine. It helps clear my head. And now I'm applying it to dancing too. Wouldn't expect anything less out of the fist of the Phantom Star. You're our fighting master. Could you quit it with the weird nicknames? I mean, is it that unusual for a student council president to do martial arts? What do you think? Suits me? <laughs> Thank you. That's a relief to hear. I wouldn't stop doing it either way, but now I can go on without worrying about it. Sounds good. Since joining the Phantom Thieves, a lot has changed. That is, I've personally grown a lot. The little things just roll off my back now. 
It's gotten easier to accept things the way they are. I can honestly say it's all thanks to everything we went through together. My time with you all was a major turning point in my life. I can proudly admit that. <laughs> you sound like you're saying your last words. We still got our whole lives ahead of us, yeah? <laughs> you're right. Well then, let's keep looking out for each other. Oh, I almost forgot! There's a certain Aikido move I wanted to try to incorporate into my dancing. I'd like to test it out now, if you don't mind. Would one of you be my dance partner? I'm down. My bones were starting to creak just standing here. All right. You're welcome to relax here in the meantime, Joker. Make yourself at home. Also, wir sollen uns wie zu Hause fühlen. Also, runter mit der Hose. Unsere erste Karte, das heißt, wir gucken uns auch hier mal ein bisschen um, denn hier waren wir ja noch nicht. Ein Bujimaru-Kun. Davon gibt es so einige hier. Ich lese mir eine Bücher hat sie. schon mal unsere Karte. Wollte sie noch so ein Federmäppchen davon? Da sind auch noch welche. Nun gut, wir sind hier fertig. Und dann gibt es hier noch unser Stolz, Justine und Caroline. Hey, you're here! I just encountered a double tsundere one-two punch. You've come to inmate. Our grand ball is approaching its climax. You've done well in generating this much hype. Listen to the voices of the crowd as you dance. That ebb and flow of ecstasy and madness. You've got them wrapped around your little choreographed fingers. It must be quite a thrill. You're so into this. Seriously, I've never seen you this pumped about anything. Your solo performances are dazzling, but in a group is where you all truly shine. Your charms exquisitely complement one another, and a greater whole emerges from its parts. And that is despite your being summoned here with no preparations. It is truly impressive. Hm, I suppose that's true. While you each have your own convictions, you've banded together for the same cause. As you faced adversity, you won the trust of your friends and unshakable confidence in yourself. These traits carry through to your performances, You have managed to impress us once again. It's only natural after you've laid your lives on the line together. Gotta give you credit, inmate. They really got put through the gauntlet. More than a few times, I thought we were done for. Well, we couldn't expect any less from our most remarkable guest, Hopeful. We personally guided him through rehabilitation, after all. Isn't that right, Justine? 
If you're so proud of our prisoner, why not tell him so? Is she finally gonna show her soft side? No! Shut up! Don't jump the gun! Have you found the treasure yet? Don't expect me to care until you do. So, does that thing even exist? I scanned all over the place, but nothing came up. Hey, what do you think? <laughs> what a shame. Not only are you empty-handed, but clueless as well. And here you are calling yourselves the Great Phantom Thieves. Guess we can't rely on just you. While you were out there floundering like fools, we decided to take a crack at it ourselves. Ooh, like how? <laughs> Do you want to know? We've quietly been undergoing training so that we may search for the treasure firsthand. In other words, we wish to dance with you all. We ask for your cooperation when the time comes. That's not what I meant at all! We're only doing this so we can find that treasure first and take it for ourselves. Then why do you always imagine yourself dancing alongside our prisoner as we practice? <laughs> shut up, shut up, shut up! Pyramine broke! Now, now, Justy, that's enough. The girl can only take so much teasing. Very well. I apologize for the commotion. To return to the topic of treasure, we are beginning to get a vague sense of its form. Seriously? Spill the deets! Once upon a time, one of our sister's guests was said to have found something precious on stage. Surely you can obtain this as well. We believe in you. Uh, what? That didn't tell us anything. Let us be off. Shall we continue practice another time? I want to disappear. Let my soul erode into nothingness. So, da ist endlich genau das, was wir brauchen. Die Schwierigkeitsanpassung der Halbleiste. Das brauchen wir ja noch für eine Trophäe. Deswegen würde ich sagen, machen wir das jetzt noch ganz schnell fertig. Und im nächsten Teil müssen wir dann sowieso wieder ein bisschen free dancen. Ähm, so, mal gerade gucken, was genau ich da machen musste. Bühne abschließen, nachdem ich die Halbleiste-Schwierigkeit geändert habe. Alles klar, das sollten wir hinkriegen, denke ich. Hatten wir nicht hier auch jetzt was? Ja, klar. Nur die Haare gibt es immer noch nicht. So, easy tanzen wir jetzt sowieso. Dann ändern wir es mal auf normal. Und dann müssen wir das nur noch abschließen hier. Get ready. You're raring to go. It's now or never, and I've got okay. to make my decision. This time it could be my moment.
was mesmerized. I knew you'd be great. Thanks. Wow, that was so good. That was awesome. Thanks. How's that? Splendid. So, theoretisch. Genau. Hyper, hyper. Sehr gut. Hyper, hyper heißt sie. Okay, dann soll es das auch für diesen Teil gewesen sein. Social Event wurde auch wieder freigeschaltet. Aber im nächsten Teil müssen wir, glaube ich, trotzdem erstmal wieder so ein bisschen tanzen, um halt so ein bisschen perfekte Noten zu kriegen, etc. pp. Das, was wir halt alles noch brauchen für die restlichen Social Events. Also Leute, bis zum nächsten Mal und tschüss.